that belongs to Jesus. Can you give God the praise? Can you give God the praise? I said, can you give God the praise? I didn't tell you to apologize. I said, praise the Lord. Let the people praise Him. 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 Hallelujah. It's such a joy to be here again. Love you so much, Pastor Ferry. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you for all you do for the body of Christ. Would you lift your hands? You see, this morning, before we start to sing in understanding, I need you to sing in the spirit. You see, our realm is the realm of the spirit. And it will, it will interest you that they don't speak English in heaven. No. The language of God is spirit. And Paul told us, Paul told us, he said, I we sing in the spirit then when it gets to a level when my understanding is fruitful then i will sing in understanding so this morning for the next few minutes i wanted to release songs of the spirit sing to him don't wait for me sing to him bless him bless him in the dark Bless him in tongues. Paul said, Come with a psalm. Sing to him. We have the one started. That I'm beginning to see the name Adonai, Adonai. I'm beginning to see that name Adonai. That means the Lord. It means the Lord. Salem, Obadiah. It means it's the Lord over your destiny. That's the meaning. Would you worship Adonai this morning? Would you worship Adonai this morning? He says he is giving us a name to press in. Adonai. Open your mouth and bless him. Tonight we worship you, Son of God. You are so good, Almighty God. Hallowed be your name, your dominion is forevermore. I worship you, Son of God, you are so good, Almighty God, come on, tell it, hallowed be your name, your dominion is forever, lift your voice, say Such a 
it one more time.
I'm not 
So in the right hand of him who sat on the throne, his clothes with in his hand, and on the back, sealed with seven seals. Then I saw a strong angel proclaiming with a loud voice, who is worthy to open the scroll and to lose its seal. And no one in heaven or on the earth or under the earth was able to open the scroll or to look at it. 
So I wept a lot because no one was found worthy to open and read the scroll and look, to, look at it. But one of the elders said to me, Do not weep. Behold the lion of the tribe of Judah, the root of David, has prevailed to open the scroll and to lose its seven seals. And I looked and behold in the midst of the throne and of the four living creatures and in the midst of the hell that stood the lamb as though it has been slain having seven horns and seven eyes which are the seven spirit of God sent out to the, into all the earth. Then he came and took the scroll of your destiny I said he came and took the scroll of your life and out of the right hand of him who sat on the scroll. <laughs> now when he had taken the scroll, the four living creatures and the 24 elders fell down before the lamb, each having a harp and golden balls full of incense, which are the prayers of the saints. And they sang a new song. Oh God, oh God, Hallelujah to the Lamb, to the Lamb. Oh God, oh God, Hallelujah to the Lamb. Oh Salem. Oh, 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 oh,
This is all.
Touch that man. Touch that boy. Touch that girl. Touch that lady. Remove the garment of shame. Wear them with glory. it increase, oh God. The angels of the Lord that brings this dimension move. Move. That's the reason why we came. That we live here changed. That Simon came and Peter is going on. That Jacob came and Israel is leaving. That Saul came and Paul is going on. Touch, oh God. softly to him now this morning. sense a very strong healing anointing over you. And I sense this one is to remove every terminal disease. Mark the word remove. Means there's not going to be any trace after this service. If you are sick in your body, especially terminal diseases, lay your hands on yourself right now. I sense the healing grace. I, oh my God. I sense this church, this altar is anointed. I sense a very strong move of the Spirit. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the risen King, 
If the spirit of he who is risen from the dead is in us, it will quicken our mortal body. Therefore, you foul devil of affliction, right now, I come to you in the name of Jesus. And I command that whatever the Lord has not planted in your body, I declare, let them be rooted out now. In the name of the Lord Jesus, you foul affliction of cancer. You foul affliction of fibroid. You foul affliction of hepatitis, autism. In the name of this above all the other days, I declare be rooted out now. Tumor disappear. My God, my father of the Asante, Kalusa the Amaradia. I'm seeing hemorrhoids, hemorrhoids. The Lord heals you now. Whatever my Lord has not planted in your body, brain tumor disappear. I said disappear. Even for the axe is led to the root. Whatever tree the Lord has not planted, I declare, let them be rooted out.
the sea saw him and fled. How great When Israel went out of Egypt, the house of Jacob from a people of strange language, Judah became a sanctuary and Israel is dominion. The sea saw it and fled. Jordan turned back. The mountains skipped like rams. The little hills like lambs. What else you all see that you fled? Oh Jordan, that you turned back. Oh mountains that you skipped like rams. Oh little hills like lambs. Tremble all earth at the presence of the Lord. At the presence of the God of Jacob, who turned the rock into a pool of water and the fleet into a fountain of water, I read this psalm by the Spirit to declare that whatever looks like a barrier before you, from this moment, I declare breakthrough, breakthrough. My God, my God, my God, my God, my God. I see breakthrough angels. I see breakthrough angels. They are turning rock into a pool of water. Whatever was up before you, go back. I see doors open. Doors open. Open doors. Open doors. Open doors. When they pass the first gun and the second gun post, they claim to the gate that leads to the city. And the Bible says it was over on its own accord. Hear the word of the Lord. Gates are now open on their own, my God. Gates are, gates are now open. Of their own accord, gates are open. Ebata, 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 Because there is nothing. You cannot do. I said there is nothing. You cannot change. There is nothing. You cannot move. You cannot shift. You cannot rearrange. You cannot crush. There is nothing. You cannot do. What about them? Because the rumor said to him, it has become as a place. Because if he has said it, then he has done it. If he said it, he has done it. Not that he will do it. I bring you the present. Days of God. I bring you the past, present days of God. Whatever He told you, He's not going to do it. He has done it. He's got the past, present days of God. He's got a track record of keeping His word. And it's not about to stop. Ay, 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 ay,
not a song I'm hearing.
put in the world by your circumstance and you find out that your circumstance is an illusion that will fall like a block of car. When you win on your knees, you win in life. Victory is here. Victory is forced in this place. When you catch this revelation, you see things change. You know, we were in New York. We were in America planning for the New York meeting. And on Thursday, the program was supposed to be on, was going to be on the Sunday. After paying some amount of money, a lot, the venue wrote us. On Thursday, I was leaving a, a meeting. Going into another meeting in Dallas. Just in the same place. Redeem, Redeem President Church of God campground in Dallas. I was leaving a meeting to go to another meeting. And we got this mail saying, if you don't pay by 11 a.m. tomorrow, being Friday, consider this program cancelled. Even if we had the Naira, there was no means of transferring. And this was after paying a lot of money. And I was getting a mail after a wonderful ministration. A ministration that was supposed to be for 20 minutes lasted 1 hour 30 minutes. So I came out, anointed and charged, going to the next one. And they brought this report to me. That just a one minute drive to the next program. That, uh, so I got into the program like you and I sat down on that and they were asking me, you are going up next in the next two minutes. I said, what do you want me to do? They said, if you like teach, if you like sing. Ah. Because now the preacher needs encouragement. I stood there, held the mic and I said, everybody please can we look away from our challenges and face God and start to worship God in, in the integrity of who he is and as I was speaking the Lord handed me Psalm 16 in verse 8 I have set the Lord before me is at my right hand I shall not be moved and the spirit of a revelation came over me I have set the Lord before me is at my right hand I will not be moved. How can I set the Lord here and he's here? And the Holy Ghost said, for you to set the Lord, you will have to change your gaze. Because the Lord is at your right hand, you will have to set. And I told them, I said, let's set the Lord before us. As we get into worship, the word of the Lord will come. And that is what will change the situation. And as I was speaking, I heard Hebrews 11, looking away unto Jesus. I said, look away. I was encouraging myself as I was encouraging them. And we started worshiping and blessing the Lord. Pastor Femi, he hit me for the first time that the miracle of abundance that Jesus did was with fishes. Every miracle of abundance that Jesus did was with fishes. I will leave the rest. I don't want to tell you the rest. And at that point, I got that revelation. Multitude of people, multitude of resources. Multitude of people, multitude of resources. And in that same place, I knew we won. Listen, no money yet. No means yet. I got out of that room and I asked my guys, what do we do? We said, send them a mail. Tell them according to the legal agreement that we signed. You cannot hold us to ransom until the end of the program and you give us two weeks according to what you got. Guess what happened? Friday morning, sir, they sent a mail to us saying, sorry, we are sorry for the mail. The program can go. That's not the miracle. The miracle was that at the, as at the time we were speaking, sir, we did not have one shame line. By the time we finished, we left money in America. 
I said the miracle, your breakthrough is here. When you catch it here, every other thing we are just.
Realizing that the Lord has given you the city. One, two, three. 